On the 20th of November at midnight, Turkish warplanes began bombing hospitals, schools and other civilian targets in the round of Kobani, including the villages of Belnia in Shaba, southwest of Kobani, which is now populated by the displaced Kurds from Afrin, as well as the village of Tekinbeki near Derik, in the east part of the autonomous region of northeast Syria. Turkish warplanes have also targeted the weak effort in the region of Dar al Arab near Zigran and the areas in the Kandil Mountains and Asas Mountains in South Kurdistan. The terrorist attack in Taksim, Istanbul on the 13th of November was a plan and executed by the Turkey's ruling AKB MHP regime to provide a protest pre pretext for these deadly bombing raids without any investigation. The Turkish regime blamed the YPG, YPJ and the PKK for this attack. Despite the immediate and vehement rejection of this baseless accusation by the Syrian Democratic Forces, Turkey's Interior Minister Suleyman Soylu, who has a long track record of hostility against the Kurdish people, continues to preach this falsehood on behalf of the Turkish state. If the global coalition to defeat ISIS is against the illegal war, then its members must immediately take strong steps through economic, political, diplomatic and legal measures to force Turkey to comply with international law. If not, they will also bear responsibility for the consequences of Turkish state terrorism against the Kurdish people and other people in Rojava. Turkey is ISIS, ISIS is Turkey! Turkey is ISIS, ISIS is Turkey! Who is fighting ISIS? Erdogan! 